Got modeling sheep fans. Lynn's the name and sheep is the game. Ooh, sorry. This uh, rainy weather reminded me of Scotland. Wrong video. Good morning and welcome to Utopia Farms. Let's go inside and see what's happening in here today. Okay, it's on now. And it works the same as last time. Her lamb is loose this morning. There they go. Come on, you guys. You guys, come here. Come here. You guys, this way. Zammies, zammies. I'm a good dictator, not a speaker. There is a new you we just let loose this morning. A late, a late you. I don't know what took her so long to get pregnant, but uh, she eventually had a lamb, first timer. She got shorn off, and that mother was is not too happy with her in the pen now. Doesn't want to share. She's with her lamb. I mentioned that, then it's the first timer. So she'll learn how to be with another group and learn how to get along. And look at these three. And Lynn's finishing off these three here. Look at how talented. And look at how small kid is. A little bit inconsistency there in the size. Still a little kit, but look at how she's grown. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know if that lamb was uh, premature, like two weeks early. Is that possible? I don't know. I don't know, but she's, she's doing well. Yeah. And the other two, look at how wide their hips are and shoulders. Yeah, the other two there yeah, with uh, with that little border collie tail. Look at the little white tip in that tail. <laughs> Sounds like a light going off. So since we're running out of room, I guess, we're going to use this pen here for the late use. Uh, and we're going to have to deal with the situation as it gets worse. Because there's four more use having others right now. So I think in about the next 10 days, we'll have another four use come in. And I don't know why they went so long. If the ram took a holiday. And yeah, if we would have pulled the ram out, then we wouldn't have any lambs at all. So is that the answer? I don't know. But. These guys right now are going to have the freedom of the pen. We'll see how long it takes for them to jump in that manger. Because the manure pack is a little higher than I like it to be. So maybe I'll spend an afternoon and take out the manure and give them brand new bedding that they won't jump in these mangers because that's a problem. We're in the coveralls doing chores now. These guys are getting their creep. Arnie's rolling out a bale of hay. And in the other side, we got a lamb race going on. So I'm just gonna walk over and see what's going on over there. Just poured rain all night and it's pouring rain again all day. 
We haven't had a rain like that for a really long time. Usually it's just uh, bursts of rain and then it stops, but this has been a steady 24 hour rain, which is good for the fields. And the sheep don't mind it because they're indoors. They can watch the rain, but they don't get wet. We have the curtains uh, quite a bit down so the air can get in, but uh, the, it's coming straight down so the barns aren't getting wet inside. You're very handsome. And your dad is handsome. You're very handsome too. So, the little Dorset rams are here. Oh, the big Dorset rams, the fall ones. And the wall, it's still standing. Nobody got through, nobody knocked it over. So I guess it worked. So we're in the weaned lamb group. This guy's walking through, but right here we had a cluster all sleeping being woken up for the morning and they're all dorsets because they all stay in their groups hi buddies hi there's angel's boy he's so nice hi who are you Hi, you're really nice. Hi. 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 Hi, you guys. Oh, you're a big girl. Big girl. Big girl. She doesn't realize that I'm doing that. he was dead but we've got a uh, same problem some of the people in the field have a ram is upside down and can't get up and of course it was uh, the ones that roll over and can't get up are uh, the big ones that was number three but there's just a little red there was just a little dip where uh, these panels fell down and uh, it was enough to get him trapped in there he seems okay, but we don't like to come in and see that in the morning. So, basically what happens when you find a sheep upside down like that, it's called being cast. And you see it a lot in the fields, um, because fields have little dips and holes in them, and sheep lay in them. And when they lay in them and they've got lambs in them or they're heavy, heavy built sheep like Texels, it's a common problem with. But anyone who's got weight on them, what happens is they maybe will lay on top of the, the incline and when they go to get up or even in, while they're sleeping, they might roll a bit and go down the incline so that they end up upside down. And because they're a nice wide sheep, the um, 
like the t coffee table I said we're looking for they're laying flat on their back and you got a little rise on either side of you so they can't tilt themselves back up and it looks funny when you see them like that and you tip them back over and they run off but it's actually not a funny thing it's um it, it can be a very deadly thing um when they're upside down like that all their organs and stuff uh, and if they've got lambs in there it's cutting off all their um circulation their lungs their everything basically it gets all squashed and they they can't survive that way for long so after a few hours even if you get them up some of them will stagger around and uh, they still may not make it. it it is a killer of sheep so you don't want that to happen but anytime you got a heavy sheep and a little incline where they could lay down um, there's a possibility that that will happen oh, quiet now as they all start to eat A dark, dreary day today, but it doesn't stop these guys from having a good time. These are mainly the ewe lambs. Oh, but there's a guy who must have hopped over because he shouldn't be there. We'll go grab him. So Ernie's giving some straw to these guys on the ram side. I feel like that's the ram side now because there's more rams than ewes on this side, but there are um, Suffolk ewe lambs on that side too. Looks like they're liking that, the ones that aren't eating. The other ones are playing in the new straw. All is a happy day. This afternoon we're just recording the Dorsets because we're going to be setting up breeding groups soon so I have just been uh, recording all the ewes that are here, marking them down so I can um, pair them up with the correct ram when we do the breeding groups. So we just got one other bunch to come through the chutes here and then we'll be done. These fall lammers are some of my favorites because um, they lamb in the fall without cedars. They're in great shape and fall lambing is so nice because it's such a beautiful time of year. No freezing, no heat and mosquitoes and bugs. Um, it's a really nice uh, time for lambing. I wish all sheep could do this naturally. The lambs are all the way at the other end of the pen, so we'll see if they can figure out that I'm up lambies, here. Lambies, come here! Hi, lambies! Lambies, here! Hi! Hi, I'm right here! I'm right here! Yeah, I'm right here! Pink! Kit! Kit! I'm right here! Hi! Kit! Come here! There you go! I'm right here. You found me. You found me. Let's see if we can feed you like this. So our breeding rams are patiently waiting here. We 
We've sorted out the U's. And now uh, Marnie's gonna clean out the barn where they're gonna be having their breeding groups so that they have nice fresh pens to be uh, romantic in. Not to mention we don't want rams uh, jumping over if the bedding pack's too high. They'll leap into the feeder if there's another ewe in a different pen in heat. So this way uh, the rams can't jump over and they have nice clean bedding for breeding. The ewes are nice and clean, the rams are nice and clean. And um, Got a few pens to clean out, and he's got a few other things, and then the rams are going to be going in. Oi, and the um, weather's been a mite wicked today. But we're going to call it a day on Utopia Farms. And uh, I think tomorrow's supposed to be a less rainy day but hopefully it's not as dreary as today bye for now